I am working on a coloring page. I just got tired of not seeing any uh, depictions or not enough depictions of people of color and I'm like you know what stop whining about it and just do your own and it's been kind of fun um, so basically I am working on a collaboration with my daughter um, and we are creating our own coloring books and hopefully you'll like them um, I am trying to learn another way of drawing braids. Uh, she credits herself as, uh, and I, I saw this video on YouTube, her name, well, she, her channel name is Art, and I found her by typing in how to draw braids. So let me see if I can try to do her tutorial here. And I'm going to just try to do an outline of where I want this braid to go. And she created something that looked like letter T's. Let me see if that'll work for me. And then she extended, well, actually she did a zigzagging motion. Let me try it again. Let's see. We'll see if we can take it from right here. So I've been doing it a different way, but they're kind of random looking. Let's see. Not go all the way to the end because we're going to extend certain areas. So she says do a zigzagging motion. And I only saw two videos on her channel. So maybe when I get off my phone, maybe I'll try to peek again and see if I can find any more. Okay, go all the way to the end, and when she says when you get to the end, make it smaller. Okay, so at every corner, you extend it out, and I'm extending the line. There we go. Oops, that one's going to be a little bit of an irregular one. Just extend that line out at the corners and it seems to work so let me see if I can fix that with my pen let me see if I can move a little forward okay and then just come around the outside of it and close it up And uh, this coloring book is pretty much going to be uh, just a, a bunch of different things. Like one of them I wanted to do, and it's we're still it's still a work in progress. Um, my daughter uh, wants to do uh, something for Black empowerment, and me, I I just want to draw like fantasy. So uh, it'll work out. Okay, I'm down at the bottoms here. Okay. And it kind of turns. Crap. Let's see. There we go. Just fall back into what I know. Mm -hmm. All right. And what I'd like to do is leave enough open space so that whoever decides to color can add different shades, an ombre tone, uh, they can add anything they want. If they want, they could put uh, tattoos on the shoulders and on the chest of the uh, ladies, or maybe I'll do that myself, or, you know, when I decide to color it, maybe I'll do a video or two of me coloring my own stuff. Um, Let's see. So let me try to do it in a curl. 
things. I kind of want these to be braids that curl at the bottom. And my idea of this was the fates, um, the three sisters. I love Greek mythology and I have this idea for a story using Greek mythology. Um, and maybe I'll try to create a, a comic book out of that myself. Maybe a web comic or something like that myself. Um, one of the biggest things that I had a problem with with creating my own comic was deciding on the style I wanted it in. Ah, uh, cute. Okay, my storage is almost up. So, anyway, I'll let you go. And I'll, from time to time, I'll go ahead and post some different ways that, uh, you know, some drawing techniques and things like that. So, um, if you do draw some things, um, I'd love to see it. Check out my Instagram. Uh, that's where some of my videos, uh, live videos are going to go. Yay, I think I've got it. And I'll see you in the next video. It'll more than likely be uh, from the coloring book. So, um, of the uh, dollar store coloring book. And be sure to check that out, like and subscribe. And just let me know what you think. If you uh, would like to see something else. Um, for next month's theme, uh, please let me know. Okay. Have a great one. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.